an early access game from Super Giants unheard of. Welcome, Hades is an, is an early access, meaning we've, we're actively working on it based on your plan, our plans and your feedback. Plan to add features, characters, weapons, foes, powers, environments, and more. We're expanding the story and fine-tuning all aspects of the experience. Our top priority around launch is to solve any stability and major technical issues as we build our first major content update. We really appreciate your patience and understanding as we ramp up. Keep an eye on the latest patch notes in the main menu for the latest changes, and good luck getting out of hell. Supergiant Games. Oh, I love Supergiant Games. And welcome to their latest, Hades. I uh, played Pyre... Didn't Pyre come out just earlier this year? It did. It came out just earlier this year, so they must have been... I mean, they probably have been expanding and or probably just had other things to do while Pyre was finishing up. Uh, and, not to mention, this is early access, so go figure that, you know, some new things... Well, it's going to be missing some stuff. Honestly, I'm actually kind of fine with it being early access. Especially if... I, I love it when uh, games have a really good base, and then they, you know, improve base on that. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything in the settings I need to worry about, so let's just dive right in. Empty slot. Few tales are told of Hades, whose very name inspires fear and penitence, reminding us of the inevitable fate which we all share. I, however, mean to tell you such a tale. Listen carefully. Goodbye, father. Ah, damn, Supergiant. Your games are... To hell with I this place. I think Supergiant games are probably the prettiest to... No, they're just the prettiest games of all. Okay, so we have basic attacks. I can kill ghosts! Sweet! Get out of here! This is my... This is my afterlife! Mine alone! Wow. Wouldn't that be a plot? Oh! These... So everything is going to be bro breakable. That's neat. It looks like, um... It looks like you actually cause stuff to come, like, crashing down, too, which is neat. Okay, right bumper to enter. So I should probably mention, this is a roguelike. So if you're looking for something a little bit more, like, linear and, uh, whatever. Leaving. Try and stop me. Okay, so how do I dodge? Uh, that's, that's not it. Do I have it? Okay. Oh, wow. That's, that's zippy. So it's like an insta insta dash. A little bit of a lag time on it, but it works. Yeah. Oh, okay. That might be kind of tough to work with. I bet you're supposed to time it with their attacks? No. Wow. This could get messy. Because do dodging their attacks just kind of gets you hit. Okay. Well, I might die horribly, but at least it'll be fun or pretty. Mainly the latter. Yeah, that is a that is a slow burn dodge attack. Wall slam, so you get extra points or or something. Or maybe just damage for uh, knocking enemies into walls and breaking stuff in the process. And I'm dead. Yeah, that that dodge is rough. It all takes some getting used to, because it, it's... You spend more time in the recovery than you do in the dodge, so either you have to dodge immediately or... <sighs> Damn it. Maybe improve it. I'm home. Welcome to the House of Hades, where... Wait, I know you. Guess that means you died out there, huh? Well, don't be sad, though. Pretty much everybody dies sometime. Some of us more than others. Oh, Zagreus, Prince of the that Underworld. Already. Sup, Dad? Stupid boy. I told you nobody gets out of here, whether alive or dead. Though so how is your wanton ransacking of my domain? Greetings, father. My ransacking was a delight, thank you for asking. 
So I'll just be on my way again. Be on your way indeed. What do I care? You shall never reach the surface. Go. See for yourself. Well, this kind of sucks. This might actually be one of my favorite incarnations of Hades ever, giving the Disney one a run for his money. What is it now? I have a mountain of infernal paperwork. Like, he looks really cool. I like his weird, like, helix beard. Actually, it's a mustache. He doesn't even have a beard. It's all mustache. <laughs> That's rad. Oh, right. Oh, uh, no. Okay. You can dodge through things. Infernal watchdog Cerberus regards the underworld prince with mixed emotions. From purest joy to deepest melancholy. You watch over things for me, won't you, boy? You know I'd take you if I could. No, Zagreus? Hello. The House of Hades. That dark and lavishly appointed lair of the underworld's king is home not just to him, but to his willful progeny. You know I can hear you, old man. Good to see you, lad. Despite the circumstances, remember your training out there. The pain of death is but another obstacle. And fear is for the weak. Take care, Achilles. Man. I hope Supergiant just keeps nailing it with his games and making loads of money. Because, like... This is probably my favorite visual style. Well, I mean, I love the visual style. But, like... Wait, was that statue? Like... Oh, no, the ghost was sad. I... A lot of people oh, wanted me to room. play... Did you miss me? Oh. Use the mirror to grow stronger. Oh! Light and darkness guide me. Each rank gives you 10% damage when you strike foes from behind. I should do that. Rank makes you heal by one when you enter each chamber. Gives you one of that for your B cast, which I wasn't using. Chain one more dash in a row. I think I'm saving for that. Because that will help a lot. The bedchambers of Prince Zagreus lie in a perpetual state of utter disarray, despite his lord and master of the house repeatedly insisting that he pick everything up. Oh, come on, it's not that bad, is it? Rest? If I sit down, I won't want to get back up. Seriously, this is my favorite, like, rendition of, of Greek myth I've ever seen. It is gorgeous. So is this the way out? Or, yeah. Okay. Maybe? Hello. So we've got different weapons to unlock Can I here. Through that pink window there. Oh, this one. So there's different weapons we can grab, but we need keys. What is this? <gasps> Ooh, look at that! I can do this. First, get past the wretched shades of Tartarus. Easier said than done, and doubtless I'll be running into Meg. The River of Flame ought to be just beyond. Find a way up to Elysium from there. And after that... All right, let's give it another shot. I like the monologuing. Like, for a roguelike, this has got a lot more plot in it. I appreciate well, it. time to go get killed again. <laughs> Even if it's a bit sardonic. All right, here we go again. I'm going to get crushed. Look who. So the level design looks a little bit drab. It's mostly just battle chambers. That said... There are some tricks here that I can work with. Okay. So first and foremost... Oh, I thought these guys were bald. Payback. Okay. Yeah, so wall slams and stuff are going to be helpful and... Wow, that's some range, too. I guess the lighter the enemy, the uh, the, the heftier the wall slam. All right. Yeah, there's not a whole lot of animation cancelling to be had. Whoop. Yeah, we need that second dash if we can get it. Uh, 
All right. Just got to keep my distance. It's interesting. It's not as fluid as I'm used to. But that's not necessarily a bad thing. It punishes you for for bad placement and bad timing when many other games would be punishing. You you really have to think about where you're going after your attack chain, which most games, oh, you can hit Shots she out is. of the sky. It's got to I be see. her. Then here goes nothing. <clears throat> In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hail, noble cousin. Now, let's get you from that miserable place. I'll see that all of us upon Olympus do our part, beginning here with me. Oh, this is neat. Okay, so we get a bonus of Athena. So... I guess for clearing rooms, we get little bonuses. So, cast shot. I haven't done any cast. Special is stronger and can reflect. We should probably use Y and B. Attack is stronger and can deflect. Let's start Thank with that. You, goddess. Your power fused with mine. This should be good. Okay, so I just chuck a sword into the ground. I want to try out the shot, but let's use it in the next room. Hey, does this get me a key? Or no, we get a key if we do this. All right. Wretches. Have a sword. Hey. Have a sword. Sword. Huh. Sword. Sword. <laughs> sword. I mean, honestly, the attack combos are probably better, but it is it amuses me. Sword. Yep. Oh. Okay. So be wary of that. Okay. So it looks like it can chain one versus the other. And it looks like you get a fair amount of magic. Hello. Alright. So that's one of the keys to unlock a new thing. What does this do? So it's not a pressure plate. Okay, I thought it was a pressure plate with, like, spikes or something. Or maybe... No, it totally is. It absolutely is a pressure plate with spikes. The spikes have just closed up because I'm done with done with battle. Uh, that's fair. Don't think I've gone this far. Numbskulls. Okay, so there's traps that I have to be aware of. Luckily, firing my sword does the trick. Ow. Okay, so I can deflect things. Gotta worry about the sword. Boom! Ow, ow. I'm just gonna drop, drop some serious swords on these guys. All right, owie. So that just keep me going for a bit. So that increases my max health. Okay, so effectively, this is just a series of challenge rooms, encounters, so on and so forth. It might not even necessarily be roguelikey. It might just be straight up uh, a gauntlet, like a pre-generated gauntlet, that gets progressively uh, harder as you go deeper and deeper in. And so, oh, oh. Yeah, progressively harder as you go deeper and deeper in. Oh, this is... this sucks. There's not... I don't have a good tool for fighting those things. There we go. Okay, so I actually get to choose. We can go... what is this? Well, I haven't seen skulls yet. I'm assuming they have something to do with the uh, ferryman. So let's go this way. See what happens. I think I hear the river. Or is this a shot? <sighs> Why, well, good to see you, Charon, mate. Just minding my own business, taking in the sights, and hey, what's that? You got some sort of wares for sale? Then I'll just have a look around. So Karen has. This shop. 
The infernal wares of the Stygian boatman Charon lie sprawled about. Available for sale, Doomever would be willing to quench the boatman's great thirst for riches. Did I call him Sharon? I probably did. I do wish that there are subtitles for this game. Are there? Captions! I'm going to turn that on, because I'm actually not hearing half of what uh, Zagreus is even, like, saying here. No use. So, if... Well, yeah, deserve that. Okay, so traps Heads up. matter a lot. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to avoid all of those, to be totally honest. I wonder if I can be hit by those. Probably, yeah. Okay, so I can actually chain attacks pretty quick here. Oh! That's some kind of weird armored skull. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Oh, okay. Note to self, can't just run through those spikes. And I'm dead. I got skull showered to death. <sighs> I was hoping I could kind of stun lock a lot of them with my hits. It doesn't really work as well as I'd like. This... Oh, captions are up top. Oh, hi. I'd ask you how it went, but since you're here again, I guess I know already, huh? Oh well, just come on in. Cheers. I love. Pardon the interruption, everyone. Okay, so things change a little bit. How you holding up, boy? Eating well lately? All three mouths full and happy? <laughs> Each terrifying maw of the infernal watchdog Cerberus responds affirmatively, one after the next, as if to reassure the ever-doubting prince. Keep at it, lad. I've known great men throughout my life, and I can always tell when someone's better than their circumstances. Fight like I'd fight out there. I'll give them hell as you once did, Achilles. Though, doubtless, many of the shades who stand against me first arrived in Tartarus because of you. Stop, Dad! So how did it go? How did you die ignobly this time, pray tell? Cerberus and I can't wait to hear the tale. In that case, I'll spare you the details. Fine. Your failure is quite easily imagined. How often it recurs. Almost as though my realm is built to keep you here. You and every single soul that's ever lived. But by all means, Continue struggling. Oh, he really does have like an infernal amount of paperwork to do. Look at this. Wait, can I t can I talk to the ghost? No. But, like, look at all these scrolls. What once was a small lounging area within the house of Hades now is sealed off in utter shambles since the multi-headed Cerberus tore the space apart, mourning the missing prince. Severus destroyed the lounge again. Whoops. Do not despair and hold to your resolve, child. Tell me something. Has the goddess Athena thus been true to her word and her willingness to lend you her support? She has, Nix. I'm grateful that you put us into contact and explained to her the situation that I'm in. It gladdens me to hear it. Seldom do Olympians consort with those born of the underworld. Yet your circumstances seem to do cause for an exception. She shall make a powerful ally. Alright, so I got 20 this time. So what else can we do with the rest of the upgrades? I know I, do, I, know I don't have enough keys for this. So each rank gives you 20% damage when you dash and then attack right away. Uh, heal 20 one time instead of taking lethal damage. 15 coins at the start. Uh, I bet you can upgrade these multiple times too. Maybe? Maybe not. Yeah, each rank. Recover 20% of the damage you take by counterattacking right after. Ooh. 
1% bonus chance for a boon to have rare effects and epic effects. Hopefully they have a lot more little upgrades than that. But then again, we get upgrades in the middle of combat too. I should go. So what what is this? I don't know. I'm buying it first. Let's see what's in here. Corridor the heart seeking box, the heart seeker. Let's deal some death. Oops, over here. What the? Nice place you got here, boyo. But enough with the small talk already. I'm here to do a job. So let me have it. Give me everything you got. I don't remember having you on payroll, mate. Who's your supervisor? Oh, I'm not about to wrap my sources, pal. Just try and beat it out of me. If you insist. Yeah, boyo. Okay, so the longer you charge, the better. Whoops. And he's dead. Oh, hello. No keepsakes yet. <laughs> Bet I got you pretty good. Okay, so we do not have access to those, and I'm assuming he is just a punching bag. The path toward the surface lies somewhere beyond all that. I love this. I wish there was more music, though. That's one thing, like, in this castle. Like, I feel like we should get some kind of uh, cool music when we're on that section. I'm assuming we can't talk to this guy again, just hit him repeatedly. All right, well, we got a bow, which should be kind of nice. It doesn't look particularly long range, but I like the fact Thunder. that you can switch it up. Hello. Is, that... Is this really him? Okay. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Greetings there, young man. Look, your father's always been rather difficult. And he is not so much as cold in quite some time. You'll have a better home where you belong, here on Olympus. And to help you on your journey, have my blessing. Alright, so your attack emits a chain lightning bolt when you damage a foe. Cast light. Your cast is lightning enchanted and bounces several times. Your dash makes a lightning bolt. I think I'm going to go with this one. An extra... Uh, you wretches. Oh. last time okay so this bow is going to make it a little easier to get through Suffering some of those guys darkness. hello composed of such innumerable ever shifting interlocking chambers the underworld of lord hades all but guarantees the dead shall there remain until the end of time good is thing this? i'm not dead I'll take my phone and look up. Is Zagreus an actual thing, or did they create him as a character? Thank you, Chef. Yeah, is he the son of Hades and Persephone? Maybe? I, I don't know. I, I've i never heard of Zagreus, but I don't actually make a habit of... Ow. Oh! Okay. Okay. Why did I do that? I should have known. Okay. Welcome. A lot of guaranteed damage here. Not a lot of shots I can really easily avoid. Though I am digging these upgrades. The bow is sweet. The sword sword's got probably better effects. This can unlock something back home. Okay, so he is actually a thing. Can't heal myself, but I can fight. Sagreus was a minor god in Greek mythology, conflated with the god of wine Dionysus. Uh, and he is the son of Zeus, Zeus and Persephone. After the former took the form of a serpent and lay with her. So, that's... Yep. Let's see. Zeus's intentions were for Zagreus to succeed him on the throne, but Hera, who's furious for the husband's infidelity, asked the Titans to kill the boy. While Zagreus was playing with the with his toys, the Titans tried to capture him. He evaded them by taking various animal forms and eventually took the form of a bull before the Titans seized him, killed him, and ate him. 
The myth continues that Zeus, realizing what happened and striking the Titans with the Thunderbolt, Titans were instantly turned to ashes. From the ashes, which were a mixture of the vile bodies of the Titans and the holy body of Zagreus, rose the humans, thus explaining why they are both good and evil. Each individual containing a bit of both kindness and evilness, Persephone managed to find Zagreus' heart, which was still beating, and Zagre Zeus placed in the body of a mortal woman, Samel. Samel gave birth to Zagreus again. Huh. That is some... Um, that is about as Greek as I could have expected. Each exit has its own reward. Oh, there were multiple exits there. I wasn't even paying attention. You made... Okay, so... Range matters here. Oop. Okay. It really does look like bowing it up is real good for starters. Come on, come on in. Okay. Kind of missed. This lightning bounce is absurdly good. And these guys are just slow enough that they're of no immediate threat to me. A mess. Let's see here. Hi there. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Why, hello, hello there, little godling. I have to say, you're quite the specimen, and so I've decided I shall aid you for the moment. You interested? Okay, special deals more damage and turns foe weak. Your cast fires a mid range six shard spread that turns foes weak, and your dash. Deals damage to the end and turns foes weak. Uh, ooh, spe double special damage is real tempting. Let's go with that. Interested in the power to break hearts? Sure, I don't see why not. Neat. I like this. This is good. <laughs> it's a little goofy looking. Okay, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna spread fire my way to victory. That's a lot of dudes. Oh, I don't want to be here. Oh. I don't want to be right in the middle of all that. So weakening foes... is exactly what I'm looking for. And yeah, this bow is... way stronger than the sword. Which means it's going to get nerfed, so I'm going to use this as much as I can. Hey! Home would practically die for this stuff. Uh, so this is how we get those relics in that display case. I wonder if we get to take it with us. I hope we do. Uh, is this the only exit? What's that? Why is that, like, splurging? I have no idea. Oh, all of these are, actually. Oh, it's just, it's just the light radius. I thought for a second there was, like, a slime. But the answer is no. No slime. And that is an easy to work with uh flash. Okay. Hold ya. I'm over here now. And I'm fleeing. Hit and run tactics are maybe a little bit on the strong side, but I'm okay with that. Easy to get surrounded. But easy to also just kite everybody away. It's a lot of them. I might just start spam casting my special. Doesn't do as immediate damage, but there's a lot of them. Shiny. Oh, that's worth a lot of money. What is this? Oh, we can just shop here. Something I can use. Ah, it costs a little bit. An infernal trove is guaranteed to spawn ahead if possible. I'm just gonna buy a bit of health. So what do we got? Sharon's sh Sharon's shop. Uh, Karen's shop. I go there. Oh, oh no, that's a chandelier. I could go to the shop, but I want to check this out. I don't really have that much money yet. Your Highness. Oh. Hey, Princess. Must look like I'm slacking off with the old boulder here, but I was just getting back on my feet. 
The Fury Sisters don't often leave me be. Where'd they go, anyway? And, um, what are you doing here? Oh, you know, just out on a little stroll is all. Do me a favor, though. You see the Fury Sisters? Let them know I was headed down the way I came from, will you? Oh, I'll let them know, all right. I hear you loud and clear, Your Highness. I'll just go about my business now, and you take care. Oh! Sisyphus furtively offers a choice of benefits. Let's go! Darkness for now. You got it. Thank you, mate. I like this. This is fun. This is really charming. I... Shell probably wants me to point out that this is the guy that endlessly points, uh, pushes the rock up the hill. As that is his fate, I guess? Question mark? I actually don't know enough about Greek myth. Uh, oh, hello. Wait, can I go this way? Oh, oh, I can gift. Sure. Hey, sir. I thought that this might ease your burden for a while. Now, hold a moment, Highness. I cannot accept something like this. Not without giving back a little something in return, that is. Thanks for that, new, sir. New keepsake, Shattered Shackle. Okay, so yeah, I'm probably just going to dump Ambrosia on everybody I can. So what's this? Power up. Delicious. Oh, so this upgrades our power up. Neat. Uh, I'm going to go with this. The lightning strike is nice, but the heartbreak flourish is so much better. Because, well, we can... Oh, yeah, this is going to be good. They must have lots of these upon Olympus. Anything else? What is this? Oh, heal. Well, I shouldn't have bought that thing. It's unfortunate. Uh, let's see. Do we have anything else here? What is this going to get me? Okay, so we could go for another... Ooh, another fruit? Well, I want to take a look at this at the very a least. place of calm and respite, whilst perhaps unimaginable in the underworld, occasionally is to be found, in fact. And not a moment too soon. Okay, Shell, just get in front of the mic. Yeah, I mean, you're like... It's the pomegranate, the palm of power! Y yes. In other words, pretty much the fruit that Hades gave to Persephone and she had four pieces of it, or four seeds, which is why she spends the winter months in hell. Well, oh. in, in the underworld. Yeah, I, I straight up don't know enough about Greek myth, unfortunately. Okay, so boon info, no. I don't know what this door is. I could go for another Palm of Power, but I think I'm going to test this out, just because first episode, must test everything. Must find out what everything is, even uh -oh. if it's a mistake. Oh. Okay. Now, were you ow. wanting me to ow. talk about all the characters ow. and lore bits as uh, time goes ow, on, ow, or were you ow, just ow, wanting me ow. to bop in here and there? I don't know. I like to oh, have, that like, was effective. I mean, obviously you met Athena and Zeus and Achilles and Nyx. I'm surprised that they included the goddess Nyx. Oh. Okay. Uh, up to you. That is way more effective. Oh, okay. This is hard. If I can even just kill one of these guys. That is... Oh, no. They have a second health bar. Of course, that's why it was yellow. Okay, well, I've got the combo down. Just keep away. As soon as I kill one of one of the two, this gets so much easier. Oh! Okay, Whoa, no, no, never mind. As soon as I kill one, it gets infinitely harder. Or... Not entirely sure. Okay, keep... Keep away. Okay. I'm just gonna run away a bunch. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Oh, okay. Probably do that when they... When you kill them, or not kill them. Okay. I got this down. Okay, stay away from that, otherwise die. There's only one heavenly archer I know of. 
Well, several, really. Anyway, in the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Oh, that was tough. Heard about you? Look, I'm not like all the others on Olympus. The power of the hunt helps keep me company, so maybe it'll help you too. Oh, that's neat. Oh, epic rare rare. That's cool. I have to pay attention to that in the future. Uh, so one thing I should probably uh, mention is all the characters with the hoods over their faces. Or mean probably that means that they need to create the artwork for yeah, them. Yeah, they haven't made the artwork yet. Because artist Artemis is one of my favorites, and I was surprised. And it's just like, oh, wait, no, no, they're probably going to, to give her a yeah. appearance later. Now that she mentions it. No reason. That sounds handy, too. No way are they just leaving her like that, looking exactly like Sisyphus and like half the other characters. And Nyx. Yeah, yeah. I, I'd be fine with them having like one or one character looking like that, but not all of them. All right, so we are in dire straits, but that's okay. Shell, you should probably make the distinction on whether or not you're joining the series or not. Well, you know me. I'm a huge Greek mythology lore buff, and... It just seemed like every other moment I was just nodding my head and Yep, that's and a character try, I know. Trying yep. trying to prompt you to give a little bit of lore I every time you encounter them. I actually have not read a whole lot of Greek myth. Again. Really? Nope. Oh, 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 oh. I mean, I, I suppose I grew up with numerous books on Greek mythology because, well, they were passed down from my grandparents and my well, you, aunt and I, I'm you I'm have Greek. Greek heritage yeah <laughs> I on the other hand am uh I was uh, even Artemis for Halloween one year I am on the other hand going to die horribly oh nope now we always do discuss when it comes to our personal ancestries you know what mythology we'd be most aligned with and for the most part your your side, like your family, is from Scandinavia and such, so you'd most definitely be Norse. <laughs> yeah. Admittedly, I haven't really read that much into Norse mythology, though. I... Obviously, it's been highlighted often in Marvel, so now a lot of people are becoming more familiar with it because that's the, where the heroes are. I noticed that DC employed the use of more. Uh, Greek characters and well, theirs. they had Time Wonder Woman and Hercules. They did right. bring him around every once in a while, usually uh, to interact with Wonder Woman. Actually, Hercules is also actually a uh, a uh, sorry. How bad could it be? Do not so much as think about it. Come and get it. Don't do that. <laughs> No. I. Oh. Well, that was quick. There you go. I got laser. Back into the river sticks with you. Yeah, there must have been one of those crystal laser things. Yeah, those bomber dudes hurt. But that's okay. We got some neat bits. I that liked the did skulls not go as planned. with the coins in their mouths at the beginning. Yeah. Oh yeah. No, this game nails nails like visual design, but that's that's just super giant. Hey, you got turned to ashes by those floating brimstone crystally type things. Next time one's turning you to charcoal with those beams of theirs, how about you step on over to the side? I had That's one health left. Idea. That's not... Oh, wait, what about Cerberus? I'm going to talk to all of them. I start I start with uh, I, I start Achilles. with Achilles, Achilles and then go down the list. Is it really true that Cerberus ripped the lounge up right after I left? He must have gotten in a lot of trouble. I only wish you could have seen it, lad. The place looked like a vineyard after a typhoon. Your lord father was livid. But he never gets so angry with the dog. Poor Dusa, though. She's picking the place up. Oh, no. As in Medusa? I wonder what became of Dusa. She's always worried father's going to fire her, even without something like this. Or maybe it is just a Dusa. It probably is Medusa. How's everything been going lately, boy? What's the good word? <laughs> the underworld prince's casual inquiry serves but to frustrate the infernal hound as none of his three heads possess the gift and curse of speech. 
I really like the narrator's quips. I mean, it's a super giant game. The narration is always fantastic. Oh, that's cool. So it's a giant lineup of ghosts. Yep, and it looks like they maybe they get their names written down, and he essentially has yep. to be a port of entry for all of these spirits. That's They really handled this like design well. Father, what happened to the lounge? The only place for anyone to have a little fun around here, and you seal it shut. Oh, I had little choice about that boy. You see, after you fled the first time, Cerberus, why, he was very much upset. Utterly tore the place to shreds. It's now under repair. All thanks to you. You're really blaming me for not minding the dog while I was out and while you all were here. I lay the blame entirely upon you, yes. Who else? It's fortunate that Cerberus has calmed himself since then. Come to his senses, I should say. May you yet come to yours. Darkness guides you, child. You have outgrown this house. Of that I am now certain. Should you return again here, I shall keep you safe. I won't forget you, Nyx, I swear it. Okay, so, episode's pretty much up. I want to check one thing. Ah, uh, right. Darkness so this strength. is arguably the most important thing that I could get my hands on. Oh, it gets more expensive as now we go along. Talking. But yeah, now I've got two dashes Can we instead stop of one. A moment? Can we go back? Uh, sure. I just want to see what's in his room. Uh, I mean, we have a gorgon skull. Uh, yeah, a gorgon skull, a a Spartan helmet, some kind of demon dog thing, bunch of books. Ton of books. Big glittery mirror with gems and stuff. Scrolls, a chest full of clothes. More clothes. <laughs> yep. There's a Cyclops, Cyclops skull, yeah. bear. And a family. Miniature skulls. There's a little family photo on the right. Do you see it? Yeah, but it's a Cyclops, a Medusa head, and then a bunch of little Cyclops. I know. I'm not entirely sure if I get the meaning. All right, so anyway, we got this now, which Doesn't is important. to try. Rubble falling from damaged pillars deals 500% damage to your foes. Not really helpful for what I'm doing, but I'll grab it anyway, and I'm just going to keep saving Ambrosia to give to other characters. All set. This is neat. I really I really dig this. And are you sure you want to use the bow for your next mission? Or? I can do this. Yeah. I can do this. I can do this. So the bow is amazing for two reasons. One, it runs. <laughs> <laughs> Two, I'm pretty good with the timing, so it does almost as much damage as a sword. Mm -hmm. uh, and look at how much damage that does. If properly upgraded, the Y move alone is really, really strong. Let me give you a piece of advice, boyo. You run across a guy like me out there, you just give him a good stab right in the back without a second thought before he sends you crying back to Papa. I'll keep that in mind, hmm. mate. He's weird. He doesn't fit. <laughs> the courtyard of the House of Hades is kept neat and orderly, in contrast to the terrifying sprawl that lies beyond. It's not that orderly, really. Oh, hey, look, there are little pomegranates in the trees. Oh, yeah, so there are. Well, this game is fantastic. It's out now. This is a surprise launch from from the uh, but it's the, the game early awards. access yes. version. Yes, it is early access. I said that at the very beginning. Uh, that said, this is fairly complete looking. Looks like there's 27 levels you can get through, and they get progressively harder. And I usually tire of roguelikes, but it seems like there's always new dialogue when you return. There's it will new boons and it characters. will get boring eventually. Like for those of you watching, probably the first. Five episodes might involve Shell, and then after that she's going to get bored because there's not going to be as much flavor dialogue. It'll just be me. And then when the game fully comes out, then we'll probably do another round of this with everything again, or I don't know. I'll be better at it then, for sure. Uh, but this is really good. This is a really good roguelike. It's very Whoa. unforgiving and definitely definitely forces you to, to lose more often. As opposed to, like, you know, Biting of Isaac, where you generally could win them right from the get-go. This one... Yeah, get some upgrades before you actually get the chance. And I'm it really is the game that you've been looking for. You've always liked the idea of progressing up or down a dungeon or a tower in order to reach a goal. And I his mean, goal is that's to true reach of a lot of roguelikes. But Olympus. yeah, it, well, 
I love roguelikes, and many of them follow this exact same, like, formula. Mm -hmm. But this one does it really well, because it's freaking super giant. I can't wait until we get the shield. I wonder if you get to throw it. It looks like you probably get to throw it. Mm -hmm. Same thing with the spear. There's also a lot of other power-ups to unlock. There's a lot to do. But for now, we'll see you guys in the next episode of Hades. And as always, thanks for watching. Oh, right, I should probably mention, this is available on the Epic Game Store. Not Steam, which is kind of weird. I'm fine with it, but it's a bit weird. <laughs>